what up what up everybody and welcome to our new series this is Genghis Khan and we are jumping into what I'm still not sure what I'm calling this something along the lines of 80s neon along with Genghis Khan and uh, this is just gonna be crazy games that are either super neon uh, like Tron ish 80s ish inspired shit kind of like we did last year uh, with a lot of Miami Vice type stuff and we are kicking it off on 310 with the release of Hotline Miami 2 Wrong Number. I'm super excited. I actually have already played a little bit of it because the fucking recording didn't work on me. So we are going to jump into the beginning of that game again. And I am so stoked on it. I'm just going to tell you right now, quite possibly the greatest graphics I've ever seen in a game. Meaning, like, title cards and that kind of stuff. Just fucking incredible. So, without further ado, let's get this shit going. Let me make sure this is going to work correctly. Yeah. Alright. Boom. Already a good start. Look how pretty this is. So, I am drinking a mojito because... why? How could I not be? Really? And, uh, I'm just super fucking excited to get into this. It's so rad. I'm bummed that uh, the first recording didn't work. I recorded it the wrong way. The quite, I mean, maybe the greatest, maybe the greatest title card of all time. It's just so fucking pretty. It reminds me of the old 90s holographic cards mixed with like acid and crazy 80s theme shit. Oh, it's just so good. Also, the options menu right here is solid too. Super solid. Big fan of this options menu. So, we are going to leave all this stuff in. We are going to kick this off. So, let's get it going. New game. First act exposition. Halloween, 91. Man, this party stinks. Fucking hate these people. Who we'll invite all these morons? Does Zebra Stripe come, dude? What do you guys think about tonight? We gonna do it? That's creepy. <laughs> Not just because the giant bears be like, we gonna do it? God, this is already so pretty. Man. Ah, oh, this is so good looking. I love the way the the slight changes they made to the uh, text in this. Because I feel like it's a little bit more blue and pink and it moves a little bit more. Ah, oh, it's just dope. I don't see why not. I'm sick of this shit. Yeah, let's do it. The weapons are in the car, right? So we're actually doing this? Alright, yeah, let's do it. Alright, so I'm this dude. God, it's already so pretty. This is a fucking rad. Also, I love that shit is, uh, you can make stuff explode in this game, too. Like, destructible environments slightly. It's pretty rad. <coughs> it's one of my favorite things that I've found so far about it. That, this music is so good. Down under. Alright, as you can see, like I said, we, we have played a little bit of this. Because actually, I am unlocked another one. Roll dodge. I don't even know how to do the specials, I just realized. Oh, space bar does it. I... Oof, that was not a good start. I didn't even... So, when I played this before and the recording didn't work, didn't realize that... Oh, that's dope that it's back and forth with different hands. Um, I'm gonna see if I can hit him through the door. Uh, I didn't ever try the special, which was roll dodge. So, that is pretty rad. That didn't work. For sure, just gonna grab this dude's gun and start mowing motherfuckers down. Screw it. <clears throat> Isn't there one more dude over there? I guess not. This dude playing some video games or something? I don't know. Oh, he's playing with his knife. 
What in the fuck is going on? God damn it. I clicked too many buttons and I kind of didn't know what I had in my hand and started getting hectic. All right, here we go. Oh, come on. We killed each other? All right. God, that door fucked me. 100% on that one. Otherwise, I felt like I was doing alright. So, I've been watching uh, Miami Vice again. I'm pretty stoked. I love that show. Also, I have uh, been watching Cocaine Cowboys because I recently saw a, a an shit interview with Jonathan Soderstrom, who is Cactus, who made this game. Him and, uh, I, forget, I always forget the other dude's name. Um, and they were talking about the two things that influenced them was, is this dude aiming at this? What is going on here? Uh, so the, they said the two things that influenced them mainly were Cocaine Cowboys, which is maybe my, one of my favorite, it's definitely one of my favorite documentaries, maybe just my favorite. And, um, it's not my favorite just because Gonzo is my favorite, but that's because of the theme. Cocaine Cowboys is easily my second. Um, oh, so good. Everything about this is so good. All the uh, fonts and everything, so into it. Uh, shit, I wish I could remember what I was talking about. Hey, look, that's a butterfly knife. Tight. What's my ammo on? I couldn't have to keep the gun. Uh, right, so it was mainly based off of Miami Vice and Cocaine Cowboys, which is a dope documentary. Alright, now that I got that, now I just need to do a little bit of this move. Everybody get got. And get got. Oh, fuck you, door. Fuck you, door. Alright, that was pretty easy. What gun do I want? Oh, let's stick with this since it's working for me. Oh, I just figured I could run in and spray him. He beat me to it. All right. Did I even get everybody? I fucking shot a lot, but I'm not sure that, nope, I didn't. Yeah, I knew that dude was gonna hear me, damn it. Oh shit! Didn't mean to do that. Alright, here we go. Now you just do a little bit of this move. Do a little bit of this move. Steal his gun. Which is a fucking pistol like an ass, damn it! Oh shit. What? <clears throat> Dang it. Ugh. Oh shit. <clears throat> All right. Oof, that was a close one. There was definitely a bullet headed at me. Boom. Fox with the kind of love the fonts in this game so much. All right, now that we cleared the level, I'm going to get to show you my favorite thing about this game so far. Which I actually, I first heard it was typed from Jonah Hill on Twitter. What the fuck is that? Uh, yo, check this out. So this is what happens when you pause the game. What? Yo, I freaked out so bad the first time I saw it. 
I am in love with everything they did in the menu system in this game. It's all fucking beautiful. Like, I could not be a bigger fan. All the tiny effects. Oh, it's just so good. Also, guns are way better in this game. Oh, did I forget the... Wait, what? Here, get in there. Oh, okay. It's because I paused it, evidently. But, yeah. Oh, man, this game is fucking so good, you guys. It's so good. Ooh, we got a new mask. All these menus are so good. This, the music is fantastic, too, from what I've heard. I think I only ended up playing the first three levels before the uh, recording fucked up. So, I, and it didn't record any of it. Because fucking... I need to upgrade my goddamn graphics card and just go with Shadow Play already. This music is so good. I've been hanging on a lot of these menu screens because the music really starts kicking off. It's so good. I get C plus O's all day. All right. So, oh shit. This looks familiar. Happy Halloween, sir. You ordered the three Zaws, right? That'll be fourteen fifty, sir. Your bazaars are on the counter to your left. Enjoy your meal and watch out for ghosts tonight, okay? Bye. Did you say balling like the plague? Balling like the plague, balling, balling like the plague. Bathroom pizza, balling like the plague. Does sound like that, right? Oh, it's such a dope. I love all these tricks transition screens and uh, menu screens it's so fucking fantastic all right oh sweet i didn't see this before seemed calm as usual at today's hearings remaining completely silent meanwhile the protests outside the courthouse continued loudly interesting I didn't see any of those before, which is not good, because that means I've been missing stuff. Leaving already? You don't look too good. Are you okay? Been a stressful day. You wouldn't believe what they had me doing. Probably go home and get some sleep. Alright, have a nice night. You do, sweetheart. <coughs> Alright. Second scene. Homicide. Homicide. Alright. Wow. Let's not do it like that again. Ooh, let's not go there. Oh. All right. That's how you do that. Now that I have the gun. You just need to do a little bit of this. Oh, I totally missed that, dude. Now what are y'all gonna do? Oh, I just stepped on his head. Oh, brutal. It's crazy that you can both kill each other at the same time now. That's pretty rad. All right. Oh, wait. This guy's not wearing a mask. I forgot. He, uh... He started without a mask, right? I didn't I didn't select one. Alright. Guns are so much better in this game. You can actually aim and stuff with them. <coughs> oh god, this shit moves now. This shit moves so much more. And stuff moves, like the there's destructible environments. Like some of this stuff will fly away, like off. Uh, and this thing falls over. 
I try I did hit that last time. Yo, I'm I'm I love all the destructible environment stuff. Shit, I, why did I waste all my ammo? It's not a good move. Oh, I grabbed the wrong one. Let's try that again. Still grab the wrong one. Oh god, come on. Ha! That's how you do a motherfucker dirty. Cause he thinks he can just grab your oh shit. Oh. Fucking come on. <laughs> Yo, that's so funny to me. I don't know why, but that really makes me laugh every time. Fuck! Alright, I need to just do this already. And start mowing motherfuckers down like I'm... Oh, shit! I missed him. I knew one of those motherfuckers had to have it. Alright. So when this guy gets close... Fuck! What? How did he not hit me? There's a miracle. I don't know how the fuck he didn't hit me. Why are there all these shit guns? Nobody had a decent goddamn gun in this place? I wanna look down. There we go. Okay, cool. I just need to make sure that I can get this dude without the other dude freaking out. So I can get this gun, so that this becomes fucking cakewalk because of this move. And now, go up here. And Gablui! Alright, that worked pretty good. Is there anything else up here? I don't see any collectibles. Collectibles, but then again, I'm awful at spotting that kind of stuff. That looks like somewhere where there would be one. So is that kind of, but I don't see anything. Alright. <clears throat> Let's keep it going. Oh shit! Ah, oh, you can't they wouldn't let me shoot. Try to remember to get on the ground now. Don't shoot up. I'm, I'm a detective. Where? Here's my badge. Sorry, sir. Lower your weapons, boys. What situation in there? We are gunfire. You, yeah, you go look for yourself. There's a bloodbath in there. God, I'm starting to get drunk. Man, sometimes I hate this city. Back the fuck up, Antonio. I will shoot all you motherfuckers. <clears throat> Whoa, it popped out the side of my car. All right, I feel like I'm doing okay on this so far. I really... The key is guns in this game, from what I've found so far with it. Because I feel like you just run on motherfuckers if you start actually doing that shit correct. Man, so I've been watching Miami Vice again. I fucking love that show. Right now I'm on... I just started again, so I think I'm on like season three no I mean episode three 
something like that. Because I literally just started watching it like yesterday. Or watching it again, I should say. Another murder case, huh? I think I swallowed a mint leaf. Yeah, it looks like you got a serial killer on your hands, Pardo. Same MO as the guy we found last week, message and all. I'm innocent, they forced me to do it. Yeah, right, haven't heard that before. Guy must be some kind of psycho, huh? Creeps me out. Guess I'll make the press happy, though. Goddamn vultures. The murders in this city, I doubt they'll even care. I think I got the voices backwards, huh? Seems they need buckets of blood before they even raise an eyebrow. This just seems a bit to be, 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 be. This just seems a bit too standard. No gory details. God, this city makes you skin thick, huh? I was born with thick skin. Huh. 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 You guys found any clues? Not really. His throat slit. Haven't found the murder weapon yet. No fingerprints, no witnesses, nothing. I'll let you know if anything turns up. You do that. Head down to the station and get started on paperwork. Alright. I'm trying to have a nice night. Just quit talking. I want to look for stuff. I don't see anything. You guys check the plant for murder weapons. What about this thing? It looks suspicious. Is that a fucking murder weapon? It's the murder plant. Do you guys check the plant? Is it holding, bro? Holding like it dated that one blonde chick in a Kevin Smith movie. Isn't that the character's name? I think I fucked that up. <laughs> anyway. Oh! These effects are so dope. April 25th, 1989, Miami, Florida. Man, this mojito is fantastic. This dude is a shit show. Nice fucking flag, bro. Man, there's so much pizza in this game. I'm starting to think I might have to order a pizza from somewhere. And since it's not Dominion, I'm not getting Domino's, goddammit. Uh, good day, this is Eric from Miami Auto Repair. I'm calling to tell you that we finished service. Okay. Swing on by Northwest Twelfth Ave Place and pick. Hey, I'm talking there. Guys, the music is so dope. We guarantee you the best service in town. Click. Don't you hire a poor major or drama? Show some goddamn respect. All right, let's go for it. You like how much I'm half-assing these voices? <laughs> Zero fucks! More drinks! Oh, and we're gonna smoke a bowl. God, these cutscenes are so good right here. Jake the Snake. Lethal throws, nice. So we know how to, oh, right, throws, gotcha. For sure, for a second, I was like, I don't know how to do judo in this game, though. <laughs> well, too much MMA. Nail gun. That's pretty dope. We'll stay with Jake since uh, you guys didn't see me play throw with Jake last time. Oh, right. Oh, this fucking level. I had some goddamn trouble with this level. Fucking for because of dumb reasons like that. Me being impatient slash not doing the right thing at the right time. And then I figured out that... Ooh, I nailed that dude without even looking, for sure. Shit. How you like me now, motherfuckers? Definitely worried about that motherfucker. Alright, not anymore. 
<clears throat> feel like I'm doing pretty good so far. The only other one that I need to look out for is all these dudes. Well, I feel like I just solved most of that problem. Oh shit! All right. Oh shit! Ooh, scared myself on that one. <clears throat> All right. Let's keep it going. Right, elevator. Wrong way. Come on, doors. <clears throat> All right. Nobody? Oh, I killed that motherfucker is why. I killed another motherfucker over there. Almost. Whoa, just realized I didn't have the gun. Fuck, I ran straight backwards. That's the one thing you can't do. Alright. Shit. I like that they do the dope, uh, blood-looking, like, Christopher Pike-style font counter in the corner. Oh shit, I almost just killed myself because I didn't have any ammo. Nobody? Alright. Oh, Jesus, I keep scaring myself with this shit. Keep it going. Gotcha, bitch. No, I didn't. Fuck! I hate the double kill thing. It's brutal. I actually really like it, but it's super brutal. and I thought I threw that gun, but I guess I hit the wall. Fuck. Oh, shit. This can't... Oh, God. I can't believe I took that dude out when he had a knife. You suck, dude. I keep trying to reload with this game. Oh, I got him. Oh, I forgot I have lethal, thr lethal uh, throws right now, too. Shit. Fucking empty. All these goddamn empty guns. Fucking annoying. Shit! I didn't see him. Man. Alright. Fuck, I need to get better with guns. Which is my new kid's show. Better with guns. We're gonna get shit ratings. Ugh. 
I just keep dumping these clips like I'm from Chicago or some shit. Oof, not good. Yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. I need to fucking amp this up. Shit. Shit. Come on. Hit the wall. Hey, dick. All right, three shots. All right, no ammo. This is going great. Trace that motherfucker and got out! Sh fucking lock on. Shit. Fuck me, man. I'm gonna have to fucking camp so bad to get through this. Fucking didn't even see him. God damn it, really? Fuck off. God damn it, really? With the fucking bullshit. Motherfucker. I knew that was coming. Who else is left? Just you, dick? Fuck off. You can all fuck off for sure. Oh, I thought that was one big last long gun. I was like, what in the shit is that? All right. Assassin style. I'm gonna take these dudes out. This should be not a problem. Then, just need to hit this dude. Did I kill the other guy? Didn't mean to. I did. Oops. Oh well. Alright. Cheers. I feel like we're doing pretty good. I feel like all things considered, I'm not doing as terrible as I was the first time around with this. I'm really liking it, too. Man, the gameplay is so good. It, with games like this, it's hard for me to not be kind of quiet because it's just so fucking intense the whole time. I'm like, oh, trying to focus. The soundtrack is so good so far, too. My favorite thing by far on this, um, as of yet, though, is still the... Hi there, welcome to my Empire Life. Hi there, Right here, I think we're taking our mind. Our addiction right here, we're sure. Okay, sure, I'll be here. Right on next Friday, two PM's hour. Friday, three beat. Can't turn it down. Falling like the plague. It has to be a day. It's a special case on sobering. Sorry, but I can't be there. Where I've been today. Hope that's all. What kind of beer is for right here? It's possible. Cuss away. Rush your asshole. Whatever you say, Russ. Alright. 
For sure, I thought that said sorry, but that's actually S R Y for sure. I'd like to welcome our next guest on the show. Famous from critically acclaimed movies such as Blue Ocean, The Calm, and Land of the Trees. Here's Martin Brown. Hi, Martin, how are you? I'm good. Now, your latest film is a bit of a step in a new direction for ya. A lot of people are surprised by this. Some are even calling you a sellout. What your response to that? Sort of. What do you mean? Well, some are saying that Midnight Animals is just another slasher flick. So I said, I wanted to do this for a long time. Kill kids, struggle them, beat people's heads in, break their eyes out, just listen to scream, see them die, slow, die in agony. I thought you had to do that now. Okay. Don't look at me like that. What? I said it's a dream, right? What do you mean? This, all of this, is just a dream, right? Well, I'm not sure I follow. Okay, pause. Uh, you think this is a dream? Well, then, maybe it's time to wake up. Who are you? Well, I say, I say, who am I? I just remember that's the voice I did the last time on a regular Hotline Miami. I'm not the one being interviewed here, am I? Oh, I think, I don't remember if I go later or say, I say, I say, I think I should be the one asking the questions. This movie you're making, I say, you know how it ends? Did you say I say in the middle? Wow, that sentence was dumb. I believe there's a pretty big twist at the end. I say I doubt you'll like it. In fact, I don't think anyone will. Maybe you gotta be out before it's too late. I don't think so. You really enjoy hurting other people, don't you? Hey, shout out. Call back. It's just a film. Just a film, huh? That's only one... Wait, god damn it, that's one way to look at it, drink. Oh shit. I've never seen this part before. This is all entirely new for me. Oh, this is the old school apartment. And there's a cops at the door. Well, I feel like this is where we are gonna wrap this episode because this is fucking intense. But I am so excited to jump back into this game. I'm having a fucking great time. God damn it, this game is good. Um, I was really worried that it wasn't going to be able to hold up to the old one. Not only does it hold up, there's a lot of things I like about this one way more than the old one. The menus, uh, more than anything. I can't believe I heard about the fucking menus from Jonah Hill tweeting about it. This shit's ridiculous. That's how... I'm glad this game's getting that much love, because Cactus is the shit. So, we're going to have all kinds of more 80 game... Oof, that sentence. Think I, you think I've been drinking a bit? We're going to have all kinds of 80 games... Wow, you guys, this is not a good sign. We have all kinds of 80s games coming up. Uh, so we're going to have, I think, what am I doing? We have uh, Vice City that's going to have the Far Cry mod on it. Or not the Far Cry, but the Vice Cry mod on it. Uh, also, I have a bunch of indies like Night Shift and Majestic Nights and a bunch of weird 80s inspired indies. Uh, also, some ones that are neon as shit uh, and roguelike. Which, you know, I like my roguelike games. Shouts out to Binding of Isaac. Oh, we haven't even covered Binding of Isaac on this game. Or on this uh, channel, huh? I love that game. So, I'm so excited to jump back into more of this, though. We're going to play through this whole fucking game on this channel. Because I'm in love with it. I just am in fucking love with it. So, look for that coming up. And, uh, yeah. I'm just super stoked. So, I guess until next time, everybody. 
go drink a mojito, watch Miami Vice episode three, and uh, I don't know, get high or something. That sounds pretty rad. All right, hey. <laughs>